You're, You're listening, listening to the More Life Podcast. More Life Podcast. More Life. More Life. This is, this is the More Life Podcast. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to episode eight of More Life. This is a special Christmas edition, and I thought, why not bring the besties on? Please welcome Courtney and Michaela. Hello. <laughs> Hi. I love it. I love the podcast voices as well. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> it's going to regress. <laughs> Good choice. Yeah. That's what I do. I usually start with my... Welcome to more life. Kind of end, I'm like, voice. and that's why. <laughs> <laughs> we love that. My phone is yeah. also like integrated. Yeah. Oh, um, thank you so much to La La Land Studios for having us with all the pink in here. There's a plant, everything like that. So it's exciting to be in a studio, a new space. I feel like I have wanted to get you guys on the podcast since it was an idea. Michaela, you're one of the people that made me want to start a podcast because you're, like, <laughs> you're like, we should have a TV show, and I was like. What if? <laughs> oh my god! And Where I took it seriously. Go? I know. I know. You're so welcome. Um, Championing the voices of women. That's it, right? <laughs> Look at you, empowering, empowering. encouraging, <laughs> building up. <laughs> um, but the reason that it's taken so long is because I was like, okay, what are we going to talk about? That's not like an existential oh crisis. <laughs> that's not super deep. That's oh, not like yeah. contemplating the political state of the world. Because <laughs> that's where all our conversations tend to go. We'll be yeah. like, that's very true. Having yeah. a fun night out. And then at the end of the night, we're like, this is why there's no hope. In this society. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, that but yeah. is very true. It's that's a, how most of my conversations do. <laughs> true. Maybe it's just your energy. I like that though. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like you want to make people want to reflect. Like, so when your mother said that to you, yeah. <laughs> tell me about <laughs> for free. <laughs> exactly. Oh man, no, no, we should be paid. We should be paid. Anyway, but yeah, thank you so much for coming on. That's I'm really okay. happy that you're here and that you're excited to speak about Christmas. How are y'all feeling about Christmas? It's too soon. Yeah. <laughs> One week away as we're recording this. No, like just over a week. Yeah. Exactly. Mm. Ten days. Yeah. Okay, that was a much easier way she's to do it. She's counting down. Santa mug <laughs> out. She's pulling out, crossing off the days from her little calendar. Where's the advent calendar? <laughs> Literally. I missed out on one of those this year, but it would have been. Don't be on sale. Is it the chocolate ones? Yeah, they're gone. They're all gone. Is it yeah. the chocolate ones that you're looking at getting? Well, yes, but they're all gone. They're, okay. They sell oh, out the really first of December. Oh. I thought they didn't make them anymore because I don't see them. I was like, oh, they must not <laughs> be a thing. they sell out the first of December. That's so mm. funny. Damn. Just buy a multi pack of chocolate and then just take one out every day. <laughs> Put it in a little pill box. <laughs> a Webster pack. <laughs> I've already got one of those. That up for you. <laughs> so, oh my goodness, I'm putting my vitamins in, a, in like a Webster pack. No, Webster pack. Okay, She's geriatric idea. now. <laughs> it's not a bad idea. I used to do it when I'd forget to take my pills. I'd just be like, bring up the old lady. <laughs> oh know. my god. My mom said, she was like, no. No. I was like, oh, no. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Um, but yeah, the reason I ask how you feel about Christmas is because I am not feeling festive right now. Mm, like we don't have a go. Christmas tree up. We don't. Oh. I don't have gifts bought. I don't have any of that. It's just like yeah, so far in the future in my head, and I'm like, oh wait, it's like, oh, no, it's not. She's gonna brave chum side. Oh. <laughs> oh, That'll put you in a. Humble. Well, I was gonna say festive mood, maybe just a mood. Yeah, right. <laughs> literally. <laughs> oh, I feel like though, when you have like a house full of older people, the vibes mm. at Christmas are yeah low. Oh, do you think that's what it is? Yeah, I think yeah. so. Because ours was like, was like on a decline, and then Derek came along, and now it's an upwards. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm just a giant child, so like it's just yeah. like I love like, it. Bring it in. Yeah. <laughs> What's it like in your house? Because you're all adults. <laughs> all, all two of us in the house. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> Wait, oh, you, I was, even, I was thinking household? about your family. Yeah. Oh, yeah. she's got her own household. Man. Sorry, and she said, "I'm grown." <laughs> <laughs> oh well, when I lived at home, yeah, when you get older, like I don't know if you really want something, you just buy it for yourself. Oh, but true. <laughs> and we yeah, like true. ended up mom, like mum and dad have this little Christmas tree about that thick. Oh, so, <laughs> oh, no, oh like and they just put one. it on a little table, little oh. coffee table, to, like raise it a bit. <laughs> try <laughs> it's good though um and then now that i live out of home like i like having my own tree yeah exactly it. oh i love um, that but yeah because yeah, i i thought maybe i was just a grinch not feeling like the full festive oh my goodness and it's coming vibes so yeah. it helps that like i know it's an adult thing maybe yeah. but everyone's just like oh yeah oh. but there was a time where it really annoyed me i was like no one remembers the reason <laughs> for the season and everything's about money and that sort of thing yeah but, oh. yeah do you guys have favorite Christmas songs? Oh. Not really. I have songs that I hate. <laughs> <laughs> hate. 
how fitting. Like Christmas ones, like yeah. Okay, you know what I really don't like? Yeah, Not to be on. negative. Never. No, I want to know. I want to know. Um, when they try and like modernize Christmas songs. Oh yeah. Like there's a Beyonce one, and she's like made a Christmas song into a pop song, and I was like, oh. I don't oh, know. That's not my favorite. I'm trying to think. I do. I do like the Pentatonix versions. Of oh yeah, that, mm-hmm. that's that's not okay. I was Ooh. like, does that count? <laughs> there isn't. Let's not Literally. put a shade on that. Actually, yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's like a really old hymn. They always sing it in church. It's not that old. Oh, um, but how gets... great that. Yeah. Because I was just Tears. I was listening to every it on time. The... Even like <laughs> the last time I went to church, I was like, <laughs> oh, stop it! I was listening to it in the car on the way here. I was like. It was the Jennifer Hudson and Pitch Thompson. Oh, version. yeah. I was makes like, me cry every time. Nice. I do love that one. <laughs> um, for me, and y'all can cancel me if you want. Okay. <laughs> I, I totally get it. Like, bro, it's been it's a year of the Chris podcast. Brown, isn't it? No. <gasps> oh. Nah, I <laughs> swear. I will not bring him to Christmas. I will not bring him to Christmas. I just exposed um, you. <laughs> Gigi's like going into the pod, like, cut that out. No, <laughs> it's okay. Um, it is Michael Bublé. Oh, oh. It's not that I don't like him. I love mine. Oh, you don't like him? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. I got Michael Bublé's no. album for Christmas once and I was <laughs> <laughs> It's not that I don't like I it. It's just, <laughs> I'm just not hyped about it. Like, I'm kind of like, oh, yeah, like, he's an ass singer. Well, like, you're not, like, cool. 90 years old, so I don't understand that. Because, like, so many people were like, <laughs> Michael Bublé, oh, my goodness, it's that time of the year again. And they're, yeah. like, playing it. Like, people went to, didn't he come to Brisbane at some point? A few years ago, something. <laughs> a few years ago, pre-COVID, exactly. Literally Probably pre-COVID. like ten years ago. Yeah, right. Um, but I was kind of like, oh yeah, like he's okay. I think that's the one thing yeah. where I'm like, okay, maybe I am a Grinch. I think you're just the wrong demographic. I do um, love Mariah Carey. Oh I yeah, I feel like they're staples of <gasps> Christmas. Don't tell me you don't like it. It's not that I don't like it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like I'll listen to it if it's on. <laughs> know me she, she wants if you it. tie me down <laughs> <laughs> like if, if there's a gun to my head yeah. i'll consider it but no no like it's yeah it's like it's it fine it but like yeah it's right. i'll tolerate it <laughs> exactly um courtney any that you're like oh, no. i'm kind of sick of this like i don't really listen to christmas movies the thing like Kristen and i get into is like we watch christmas movies but oh, we uh, we'll like judge them <laughs> mm. Like our favorite thing to do is watch like a cringy movie and like predict the things that'll happen. Oh, and, stop like, it! I love it. Just <laughs> judge all the tropes, you know? Yeah. But yeah, yeah. don't really listen to like yeah Christmas. Interesting. Movies. I love it. I think or the Christmas one music. that I recently has been making me feel some type of way is Mistletoe by Justin Bieber. Oh, <laughs> it makes me want to fall in love, you guys. I'm just like, oh god, stop it! Like the bells in the background. It's I don't like... think I've ever listened to it. <laughs> have but he's like I won't oh, say okay. that guess no, what? Say I want to know what is it and I was literally going to say I was like I guess what we're listening to nah. <laughs> look he's kind of irrelevant to me but <laughs> but One Direction isn't uh, yeah One Direction isn't <laughs> <laughs> I don't listen to Justin Bieber, but like he probably comes up when you just listen to playlists, exactly, and I just don't yeah. think about it being who's Justin singing. Bieber? Yeah, mm-hmm. oh, that was man. a bit harsh. Sorry, guys. No, it's all right. Like, Sorry to all the Justin Bieber fans. If you're listening to this, it's not like I'm a Justin Bieber fan and obsessed with his neck tattoo. It's fine. Like, it's all right. oh, oh, neck tattoo. He does. Oh, yeah. She got a tie. <laughs> She's got a tie. What does that mean? <laughs> no, she doesn't have that. She gets more worried with her tie every time we hear about it. Well, I'm gonna get a neck tattoo. So. <laughs> I'm dead. I was thinking about you know the no nah, actually I'd go it's so classic but like the little cross behind the ear. Oh, you could you imagine if you walked home with a cross behind you? Like you could have I'm Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Love to and be your a fly on the wall when your parents. I, are. Actually, <laughs> I don't think I've touched my parents about tattoos because I haven't been that serious about getting them. But oh. like no, I would definitely get a little cross somewhere. I mm. sent. Do you remember? it? This time last year, I sent you a picture of the cross on my wrist. Oh, that's true. And you're like, oh, guys, yeah. you're like, you can see that's fake. And I was like, damn, I thought I was going to get away with it. Yeah, it's so unbelievable that you would get a tattoo. I'd be like, oh, oh stop shop. it. Yeah. She's going to shock us one day. Literally. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This is going to be like a long, <laughs> long, long process. Like, yeah. Maybe no, you will I'll get a tattoo. I'll take you somewhere good if you're going to go. Don't just like get like Ooh. someone. Really. Celebrity ink is what I heard people go. Oh, it would like not celebrity What if they ink? come for me if? <laughs> what do you mean come If for? I talk bad about them, then they'll cancel it. <laughs> we'll split the cost of the boy. Oh, 
<laughs> oh, on the podcast. Sorry, I've got you. I don't know anything about them. That's just a name I've heard thrown around. So. <laughs> I think they're run. They're run by um gangs. So you better. <gasps> Is that a thing? What? Yeah. I've missed something in the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think like this is your own time. You're just like, hey, how did we... Yeah, sorry. Backtrack um, it a bit. <laughs> no, no, no. Tattoo parlors are traditionally ran... Like, they're, like, fronts for gangs. Oh. Yes, actually, no, I do remember that scandal a while ago. Damn. Yeah. In, like, in it's our like, area. Yeah, it's, yeah. like, not my, like, lush little one on the Gold Coast that's painted white and it's <laughs> concrete. That's not it. a gang front, but... <laughs> Boutique. <laughs> oh, is it like one of those money laundering businesses? Yeah, where it yeah, looks yeah, like, yeah, yeah, I yeah, find yeah, that yeah. so funny. Like, it's just such a... <laughs> Crime. Like... Humorous. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. Oh, no. I just mean, like, the... <laughs> Say <fact> less. <laughs> <laughs> I just mean the fact that there'd be, like, this shop front that's, like, super cute, but in the back... Okay, maybe it's not funny. <laughs> Okay, I'm just thinking, how do we get from Christmas carols to money <laughs> This is us all the time. We are going to take a zero to one. And then in a second, we'll be talking about and it's the, the Balenciaga pay pay pay. Pay. <laughs> but Anyway. I'm trying really hard to not be like super intellectual. I mean, I just did it before. Look, we probably will. We'll come back it's next year on More Life and we'll be debating everything. Mm, get ready. Yeah. But back to Christmas. Do you have oh. Christmas cr- traditions? Oh, like when we were kids, we used to go to the Christmas carols on Christmas Eve and oh, then go cute, look at the Christmas nice. lights. Oh, I, I don't know. That. As you get older, you don't really like like we're saying. Like when mm. you're young and you're kids, and you, it's all exciting. But yeah, when you get oh. older, it kind of hit twenty and lose all hope. <laughs> <laughs> if your parents like texted you and were like, "Hey, we're thinking about doing this again," this is. Yeah, I'd do it. Yeah. And plus, like, now, because I, like, work over Christmas, I can't really, like, plan to do, like, a consistent tradition every year. Cause yeah, I'm, like, true. It's mm-hmm. all busy with, like, I literally go to work and then go to Christmas things and repeat and then oh, yeah. just, mm-hmm. like, yeah. Oh, but I think sad. it's, like, leading up to Christmas, like, like I said, like, Kristen and I will watch some movies or if there's time, we'll go to the Christmas lights. But, yeah, oh, true. Yeah. That's fun. I love it. Mm-hmm. Michaela. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, so we put out Pepsi Max. It, like, you know how, like, kids put out, like, milk and cookies for Santa? Yeah. We put out Pepsi Max and um, gluten-free biscuits. For that's gluten-free so for me. Yeah. That's, like, that's Dad's favourite. <laughs> oh, I love that. It's, like, hard now. So it's, like, you know he's Santa. Oh, I killed that dream for my siblings as soon oh. as they could. <laughs> I don't remember said, finding out Santa wasn't real myself. It must have been like my cousins or something. But yeah, yeah. I told all my siblings. So it's only Derek who has who actually still believes in wow. Santa. Yeah. So I we Damn. have this argument every year where we're like we're putting out Pepsi Max and some gluten free cookie or something. And he's like, no, it has to be milk and cookies. And I feel like telling him Santa's not real. <laughs> <laughs> what we do in Australia. Exactly. Pepsi Max. <laughs> But anyway, Ooh. I was having this argument with him this morning. I'm like, we'll do two then. We'll do two. <laughs> yeah. Because he's like, like killing my tradition. I'm trying to. No, hold definitely. On to no, it. hold on to it as a, as a tradition. I like that. Mm. It's cool. That's mm. cute. I feel like I definitely. I also can't remember how I found out Santa wasn't real or oh, when yeah. I did. But I wonder if I just never believed it. That's what I thought. She's skeptical. Because even with the tooth fairy, I feel like I never really believed in the tooth fairy. Or even when I started to, I was like, well, why would I snitch when I could get free money if I pretended? Yeah, true. I remember like... She was a hustler. I remember going to my... One time we were staying at my grandma's house and my auntie lived with her. And I like didn't find the money under my pillow. And I was like, walked up to my auntie and I was like... Yeah, the tooth Where fairy didn't come. So, and like, I knew <laughs> while she was a tooth fairy. Pay up. And then, oh your bill God. is due. She's a business <laughs> woman. And she was like, oh, it works differently here. You have to march around the house. First it works to differently get it. Yeah. <laughs> She'd obviously forgotten about the whole oh, thing. No. She was like, oh, wait, this kid is staying with us. So um, and so I like walked out, walked around the house, came back, and there was money. And I was like, wow, oh, my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> Oh, I'm pretty sure it was like gosh. a note as well. Oh, a note. <laughs> but yeah, oh my goodness. Oh, that's too good. I love it. Derek's definitely gotten a few twenty dollar notes before. Oh, so we've been, like, yeah, we've been like, there's no coin. <laughs> <laughs> my mom would be like, where's the loose change? There was no like tooth fairy situation. IOU. My mom used to do IOU. He's a fifty cent. <laughs> IOU's on the tooth fairy. 
When you got five kids, you got your loser yeah, loose change. Quickly. I know. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> um, would you guys keep the magic alive for your kids? Do you think? Like, mm. oh, again, I was discussing this with my boss the other day. Mm-hmm. No, because I think you're, like, lying to your kid from the start. Mm. You're, like, building up that level of, like, distrust. Yeah. True. true. It and then you'd be like, you I'm telling you something, you believe everything I say, and then I'm going to kill it for you. Oh. True. Oh, wow. She said psychology. <laughs> <laughs> I My love kids it. will not go to psychology. Oh. <laughs> no. no, that's so fascinating. I've heard someone, the other opinion I've heard, or the other thought I've heard behind why they wouldn't was something similar. It was, like... Yeah, I don't want to lie to my kids mm. and there's no need to like create this fake world where you can be like, oh, I like, you know, your tooth came out, let's celebrate by giving you money. <laughs> yeah, like I think that. you yeah. can still keep the magic alive. Like I'm, what, 23 and I'm still like, stand up. Yeah, literally. <laughs> yeah. I feel like, I feel that definitely, and we might see this when we go to the spectacular on Sunday. Yeah. Like there are some things where I'm like, oh, it's Mary. Oh my goodness, Mary's here. <laughs> <laughs> Not Mary. <laughs> It's about time she gets some recognition. Yeah. Even if it is 2,000 years later. Facts. Facts. But the Catholic's been on it the whole time. <laughs> what? As not they've recognized her, you guys. <laughs> that was not gender specific. <laughs> You can't, you're, you're gonna have, have to, to do a trigger warning on this. Podcast. Oh no, you're gonna have to cut this entire. No, no, no. You know what I love doing? I love cutting out what the actual funny thing was <laughs> and just posting the laughter, and then it's never in the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Leave them guessing. Literally. <laughs> um, would you keep a magic alive for your kids? It depends how light of their faces <laughs> year after year. Like, oh, some people go to so much effort. You see those people, and they put like the flower with the I've footprint. Seen that. <laughs> Bothered to do that. Courtney would not keep You're it alive. Oh, I'd be flat out taking them to see Santa in the shopping center. <laughs> You'd be like, oh. I feel like you know what you would do? You would be like something like, oh, that's right. I haven't put like yeah. the money under your pillow. And they'd be like, what? And you'd be like, oh, yeah, uh, sorry. Um. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to have to cancel. No Who knows if like loose change will be a thing when we're having a right? man? Oh, my God. Bank transfer. Bank <laughs> transfer. <laughs> What's your bank details? Pay ID. Oh, pay ID. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, my goodness. You know what I find weird? I've only ever had one white Christmas in my life. Oh, yeah. But. It's one more than me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, but for some reason, whenever it's like, because Christmas is hot here, yeah. it doesn't feel like it's proper Christmas. I don't know if it's because of the movies we watch yeah. or something like that. Mm. Do you guys feel that? No. Is just like you're used no, to. No, this it. is like yeah, this is like Christmas. I don't know. Is this same for you, Courtney? I was gonna say maybe because you were born in another country. Oh, yeah, but no, like it was snowed in there. America. Yeah, and no, it's in the US. It. But that was one year that. Was oh yeah, white. true, mm-hmm. true. Yeah, that's why I'm like it's so weird because I've grown up with like a warm summer. Yeah, maybe. And then had one you've... taste, and I was like, okay. I can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it is more magical to have like a white Christmas. Yeah. Like I want to have a white Christmas one day. Yeah. Sure. Instead of being like out the balcony in like. <laughs> Your big 32 Many. degrees yeah. like far out. Yeah. 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 True. I feel like the lead up's just less magical. Yeah, exactly. Because yeah. like all the Christmas movies, it's like, oh, it's snowing and we're going to do baking and oh, we're going to put up the true. tree. And it's just like, it's hot. You're putting your fake tree up, <laughs> dragging it out of the garage. Like, <laughs> like dusting it off. Oh, Our tree isn't even up yet, man. Oh, like, bro, oh. As long as it's up by Christmas Day at some point. <laughs> literally, literally. Get a branch out. It's fine. <laughs> oh, my Christmas tree, yet. like, because it's just Nan and I. Yeah. Um, My Christmas tree is three olive branches. <laughs> Oh, in a pot. It's a bit cute. biblical too. It's kind of cute, right? <laughs> oh, you know me. Up with the biblical tra- <laughs> traditions. Um, <laughs> Definitely someone... not scrap waste from work at all. <laughs> Damn, you're really barely making it into Christmas. You're like... <laughs> um, this lady from our workplace said that they like something happened with their tree. So they just took a cardboard and cut a tree shape out of it and then put it in there. <laughs> oh, no. Like, oh, it's getting desperate times oh, out here. Yeah, that is desperate. I'm pretty sure we can get any kind of plant. People, and then just call it like a bit 
different. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> yeah, there's like there's like just fun versions these days. I've mm-hmm. seen some cute stuff out there. Yeah. Mm. Or just yeah. put like some people put lights on the wall and just zigzag it. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Google would do that. Yeah. You'd yeah, have something I'm super chic. Super in your house. sleek. Like yeah. Just like yeah. minimalism. minimalism. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> well, I've been like keeping well. up with like the trends because you know yeah. floristry mm-hmm. trees. Same yeah. difference. Oh. Um, I saw a lady put like cover her. It was ugly. Preface, but <laughs> she covered her tree with hydrangea and um orchids, and I was like, oh, creative. And orchids. Well, it was ugly. Oh my gosh, what kind of what kind uh, of budget she, work- she got? <laughs> she was working with a <laughs> budget. Stretches. That tree. Wait, like the real ones. Yeah, that oh, tree that. was my entire wage. So. Oh wow. Oh my god. Really? Yeah. yeah. Um, I did see this thing. I might cut this out. I saw this <laughs> thing being like, I'm so sick of people having this like sleek, minimalist, like lifeless um, decor in their house. Um, I'm going to have all the color and everything like that. And people started, there was like a Facebook group and people were posting. They're like very opposite of minimalist. Mm. I'm sorry. I can't do it. It's ugly. Like it's, I can't do the, like, right, the multiple, minim- like, like colors mixed, mixed together, no, like clutter, I like all that stuff. Mi- I can't. Yeah. Minimalist. I like, I do love it. It's good for your brain, isn't it? Yeah. Like yeah. just like walking into space Clean and it's space, like very yeah. simple. Yeah. yeah. I feel like it, the the people that find it polarizing is like the child development. People are like boring beige toys for boring beige uh, yeah. children. I only get that to an extent if it's like there's some things you're like, oh, that actually looks really fun for kids. And then mm. they're like, no, but it doesn't fit my minimal. Yeah, exactly. Style. And like clothes and stuff. I'm like, they're just a kid, okay? You're not Kim Kardashian. You can be. beige clothes. <laughs> <laughs> you would. Gugu's Even modeling her like house off Kim Kardashian's compound. <laughs> oh, I still, you know, I still haven't really seen it. The only, gr- I've seen, um, Chloe Kardashian's garage, but not anyone else's. No, they all kind of have normal houses, but like Kim's is like sleek concrete, like everything oh, yeah. in the kids' rooms is like white beige oh. brown kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Yeah, you'd love it. I'll have a look at it. <laughs> yeah. The only reason I've seen um, Chloe's garage is because it was on the home edit, which is this show about reorganizing and oh, yeah, cleaning. And I was like, mm-hmm. Have you not watched the Kardashians? Not really. I oh, think I yeah. used to when I was younger. Like she watched episodes, the latest season. I actually like it. Is mm-hmm. it? Well, it's the Kardashians. It's not. It's like of okay. <laughs> something to not think about. You know. For sure. Sometimes you just need to watch something that you're like. I don't need any brain. Brain space. That was yeah. me with um, things like Brooklyn Nine Nine or what else? <gasps> Dairy Girls. Oh, how good oh, is Jerry Girls? Have you watched the latest season? How yeah. good? I, can't, I like, stumbled upon it. I that was like, first what? episode of the new season was good too. Wait, I'm trying to remember what that was. <laughs> it's like when they like literally just hand those computers off to the people. <laughs> oh, <yes. laughs> And then they end up in the, so like, in the police station and they call that uncle who never shuts that up. That so got funny. me, man. I have a lot of patients like that uncle. Oh, the I ones know, that I just know. don't stop talking. So oh my goodness. You try to like close the conversation and they're just like, and this <laughs> or like they're back starting out of like, the door. Anyway, um, and you're just trying to find gaps in their speaking. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love oh, it so God. much. Do you we think are... it's finished? Like, is that the end? Yeah, it is. I think that's oh, so sad. Derry Girls is like the only, one of the only shows that makes me like actually laugh out loud. Yeah, yeah so exactly. Real... But I laughed and cried. Yeah. Real cried. question is though, who's your favorite Derry girl? Ooh. Oh. It's got to be, um, it's not Claire, is it? Claire's my favorite. <laughs> Wait, Claire's definitely like the one... She's the one that'll be like in that one episode. She's like, oh yeah, we have to have a united front. We have to have a united front. Get in there. It was all her fault. <laughs> she cracks. And I'm just like, I, I love, love this. She's the one who was like, did, did we just hand over it? Like that's yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. I love it. I love so it. Good. I love it. Yeah, no, she's good. Cool. Or the nun. The main the nun. nun. Yes. Oh. Oh, I love her so much. She's, she's so like so monotone and like so yeah. hilarious. For <laughs> someone who looks like she hates children, like why <laughs> are you working in this school? Do you remember oh. that season with the priest that was, wasn't he odd? Like wasn't like, he yes. not really priestly? He was like oh, young. Guy, priest? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought he was questionable as well, but maybe he didn't do yeah. anything. But maybe it's just what they were saying about him. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Oh, no. I would um, rewatch that. Oh, I don't even remember. Who's the girl with the like curly brown hair? And oh, Michelle. Cousin? Michelle. Oh, I love Michelle. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> they really hate I on just, James for no reason. Yeah, oh, yeah. I love her throwaway comments to James that like kills me. She's like, nobody like, likes you. Exactly. <laughs> I know. And worse, he's English. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, so it's so fascinating seeing like the history as well though because it's like oh, it's yeah, funny yeah. 
And then they'll like just walk past this guy with the machine gun or it's yeah. super funny. You're having a good time. And then there's a bomb that went off. Like that yeah. sort of thing. Like yeah. just seeing like, oh damn, it was actually a terrible time. But they're like yeah. still teenage girls trying to have a good time. Like, yeah. Sorry to the Irish and English out there. <laughs> <laughs> it seems to be really deep. It but it wasn't until I watched Stereo Girls and I was like, oh. Yeah. But that was probably what life was like. You were trying to like grow mm, up. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Why do you, is it off? Anyway, this is so off, top, off topic. But is it like modeled off? A true story? I think it is. I think so, yeah. yeah. Isn't it the yeah. writer's story? Like the yeah, director or whatever so. creator's story? Mm. Yeah. That's what yeah. Feels. Speaking of Christmas during summer, don't forget to get your skin checked. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> she worked that one in last minute. <laughs> I know. Because <laughs> I was like, we need to talk about this. I have never done my skin check, but like, y'all should. Um, but yeah, should. just because... <laughs> we live in <laughs> Queensland, <laughs> the worst state for skin cancer. Is it really? <laughs> Pretty sure it is. Australians are like because it's so warm. Everyone twice goes to the beach. like three times more likely or something. Actually, don't put that in. Don't fact check it. <laughs> <laughs> I read it today, but like so we only need something crazy like ten minutes of like direct sun. Oh day, yeah, because our sun is so harsh. Yeah. Oh it's wait, I did know that. Ozone layer. I did know that apparently even I need like just fifteen minutes of sun on my hand is enough. As mm, yeah, like you don't. You just need it on your like main. What are these? Appendages. <laughs> limbs. Appendages. Yes. Yeah. yeah, limbs. I don't like the word appendages. <laughs> appendages. <laughs> yes, um, well, get your skin checked. I have something really. <laughs> okay, can I expose myself right now? So I watched this TikTok it. about how you can look up everyone's upper registration. Yeah. yeah. You'll be glad to know that both of yours are clear. <laughs> <laughs> I looked up my own doctor and I was like, well, who other practitioners do I know? You're like, well, I'm so, here. But I'm like, okay, I'm not everyone else. Yeah. Can I show you I'm legit, guys? <laughs> I just paid my $700 renewal. Of... Bro, why is she so expensive? No, it's the insurance. The, like, Aww. physiotherapy insurance. All right, we're going to wrap up with a little Christmas this or that. Oh, yeah. Would you Ooh. rather vibe? Um, would you rather give gifts or receive gifts? Give gifts. Give gifts. Oh, really? Oh, that's so nice. So humble. Gifts are at the bottom of my love language. I'm like, I can't. <laughs> um, white Christmas lights or colored Christmas lights? White. White. But I kind of don't care. <laughs> but also Same. don't flash them too much because I feel oh, like I'm going to have a yeah, seizure. No. <laughs> oh, stop it. Um, I'm definitely, I like the sleek, simple, so white lights. Oh, yeah. Christmas music? Basic. Or Christmas movies? Movies. movies. Really? I love, I love the like, Bad, <laughs> yeah, the bad, the bad movies? Netflix movies like the Vanessa Hudgens one. I was yeah. gonna say, I've there's that a Lindsay one. Lohan one that I really want to watch. Oh, it's good. Yeah. I think I'm gonna sit down. <laughs> like a <laughs> I got it. Got review. I'm yeah. gonna wear my Christmas pajamas with my Aww. Christmas I love that. cup and yeah. watch my Christmas. Maybe I should just make like make it a tradition. I'm not really a Christmas movie person. Like I think I used to be. Like I watched my mm. like, Alone and stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> also good. Yes. <laughs> but, yeah, Lego set is for Chris, that. Now. Is Home Alone a Christmas movie? No. Yes. I think one of them is the isn't first it? one. Yeah. Well, they go away for the holiday. No, all, both of them they go away for the holidays. But you want to call it a Christmas movie? Would you? But it is because around this time of the year, there's this post that goes around, which is a picture of those robbers, and it says, "Watch out! I hear these people are targeting people oh. that are home alone." My mom sent it to me. I think she thinks it's real because it was sent in like our community group. And she was like, sent it in there like a watch out, guys. Oh my god! <laughs> but yeah, um, <clears throat> I th- I think Christmas music for me. Yeah. Um, Justin Bieber. Yeah, she <laughs> loves it. This is so bad. Not um, Michael Bublé. <laughs> Take him off. <laughs> Take him off my roster. <laughs> um, would you rather have Christmas at home or Christmas while traveling? Home. Oh, it depends. By myself, <laughs> traveling. <laughs> with my family, home. Oh, <laughs> you're like, I don't want to travel with family. <laughs> oh, no. No, no, no. I feel like I'd like to travel one year. Well, I have to if there's mm. going to be a white Christmas. Exactly. That's what I was going to say. I was like, I love the idea. Europe 2023, Europe, Courtney. But... <gasps> Bro. <laughs> 2023? No. Maybe not, we'll not I was like, you didn't tell me about this. We didn't have a schedule. <laughs> um, Where are you going to come, though? Also, I changed my mind. I want to come. You know oh. how I said I didn't want Okay, it. don't I cut that bit out. No, oh. Europe. <laughs> I was like, girl, we're going in like 10 weeks. Right. I'm sure I could if I, right? Yeah, you could, could if you want something. to. I, I slip it in your car I on that one. I still have to find my <laughs> northern territory. 
I mean, I could try. <laughs> Where we stayed last time was a pretty safe area. Bro, that little Bali. alleyway we yeah, had to walk like, down. No. no, that villa place where we stayed, that was like very like nice. Yeah, yeah that with that whack like... kiwi dude with his bar with his kiwis. Like... <laughs> I'm joking, sorry. I was a kiwi. I thought he was just trying. No, I loved him. No, that was not a safe area. That was like no. so far. No, okay. So like, of, like most Balinese people are super lovely. So we were probably safe. But mm. in terms of like six 18 year old girls we should have been in <laughs> like courtney showed me where we stayed and i was like it was so far, so out, far out like we should have been smack bang in the middle of seminyak maybe but i thought we wanted to avoid the fact that it wouldn't be safe there because everyone's targeting tourists yeah that's western white girl behavior that was so unsafe <laughs> what about that, that, that massage we got i feel like oh. i needed to follow a report after coming out of that <laughs> look personally i liked it i thought it was nice <laughs> i was fine i just but Oh, no. Well, <laughs> came out. It was like, I don't know. Just... No, no, no. Standing <laughs> the there, like... like fully naked, and like opposite <laughs> your friend. And Every you time I turn, like, go, go, look away. Like, Stop it, don't look at me. <laughs> like they Stop. push you down. Yeah, yeah I see, like no. I was like, like, like they were like stand up. I was like, but I need to stand up. <laughs> I was just thinking about you guys the whole time because, like, obviously, yeah, the person I was with, I was like, whatever. But yeah. I was like. Oh no, they're coping. How's the rest of them going? <laughs> I had started studying physio by then, so I was fine oh, with so bodies. Fine so with I was bodies, like, oh, yeah, yeah. it is what it is. Um, but I feel like the funny part was when we walked out, we just watched in silence towards <laughs> the register. I'm just like, <laughs> oh, the thing that killed me was like trying to relax while these people are like opening, shutting the door, and I'm like True. fully exposed because oh, yes. there was no water. That's and right. I, I wish I had known because it was yeah. freezing and it was not warm. Really and I wish I had known because I would have said to them, Bro, don't, don't even worry about, about it. Because yeah. like you guys we like, need the bath. No, <laughs> it's cold in the bathroom. No, and and no. I always felt so violated by the end of it. I was like, <laughs> no. No they kept coming to the bath and like pouring the hot water in bit by bit, <laughs> coming back and forth. And I was like, oh, that's no. enough. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Maybe in there I had to synchronize my breathing because she cut me off every time <laughs> it was so rough what? it was so rough she now I'd be, now I'd pay good money for that kind of shoulder massage like I was gonna I, say I really really liked reset it. my entire it. body but <laughs> the last one savory food or sweet food over Christmas savory 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 oh wow yeah. guys it's so easy yeah. stop it wait don't worry oh I'm curious no tell me I was gonna say we didn't talk about how we Man, that's oh, that's there. right. How did we meet you guys? Well, we <laughs> went to New Caledonia. Well, we met all what? through school. No, <laughs> <laughs> no, but we became close to no, friends. No, no, exactly. no, 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 no. We met at school. We we went to school. Yeah. Oh, when did you go to? Okay, hang on, bro. <laughs> no, she missed notice? a chapter. <laughs> you went to New Caledonia in like year nine. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, what term was that? Is that term one? No, term two. It's like the end of the year. Okay, oh, like, okay, okay. All right. Sorry. sorry. I, was like, I was going right back to the beginning of like when I joined. But anyway, when you let said me not, term, I was like, well, I let me well, not <laughs> interrupt you, Courtney. You go first. But you knew Google well, before then. Yes, we all met through school. Mm-hmm. But then we decided to go on this French trip. I don't know why. I... <laughs> no, it was. It looked epic and it was epic. Yeah. So I said it looked epic and it was. Oh yeah, epic. epic. Yeah, yeah. It was good. Um, little money raising situation, a mm-hmm. little bonding through crepe sales, which you know sometimes Google would try to ditch me at the last. Day. Oh, stop it! I have things to do. Uh, I feel Dimmel. like <laughs> I feel like I don't know if this is how it happened. If this is how it was in my mind, but I feel like you came up to me and you're like, "Look, we're going to be stuck together on this trip. Why don't we like become friends?" <laughs> probably, did so probably. Well. something yeah. along those lines. But it was basically There's like... things that come up that I said when I was younger that I don't remember saying. <laughs> oh, you're like, I have no recollection. But I'm like, um, <laughs> sounds. Right. <laughs> um, but yeah, essentially, we're like, look, we're going on this trip together, spending a lot of time in the lead up, and yeah. then we went on the trip. I feel like by the time we went on the trip, we we're like already like that. We're like, yeah, yeah. Well, this is it. Of course. Spend time with each other. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Okay, well, my turn. <laughs> so I'll go back to day one. I remember day one of year nine, you introduced yourself to me, mm. and then I got introduced to Courtney at some point. But you were my friend from the very first day, from the very first oh. person. I walked up to her and I was like, okay, eyelashes. I'm going to need some tip. <laughs> so we've been friends since like day one of me joining. I think you were After day she two. was, can I say it? Quiet. I'm schooled. <laughs> <laughs> we were friends from like literally the minute I arrived. Mm-hmm. And then Courtney and I became friends at some point. Uh, but it was like day two. I don't oh, remember. Right. Day two or Courtney, you, Your memory. And so... It's Sorry, been how many years since? 
Oh my goodness, it's been a lot longer than I thought. 2013. Six? Nearly 10. This is 2013 is when you started at Nearly 10. No, I... Oh, yeah. <gasps> no, I know. I just gasped. I was like... <gasps> oh, okay. No, no, no. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow, Damn. look at us go. I know. Uh, you know, you're Can the you? longest running friends I've ever had, except for my brother. Wow. It's not include your brother. But anyway, he's <laughs> my best friend. <laughs> wow, look at us go. I can't believe that. Before we head out... Mm. What does more life mean to you? Just literally your own interpretation. When you hear more life, what do you think about it? Different perspectives. That's what I had come up with. Nice. <laughs> nice. I like that you don't have, like you said, you don't have a niche. So mm. like the different episodes. Nice. Yeah, I guess you I encompass like that like vision mm-hmm. within the podcast. Um, I thought of the word balance. Oh. Because I feel like, you know, if you balance all areas of your life, mm. Then you can have more life. At least that's Ooh, how I felt. Yeah. Oh, oh, I love it. it wasn't until like I like balance all areas in my life, and now I can feel like I can actually have a life. Yeah, true. Damn, I'll try that. Mm. I love it. Balance <laughs> boundaries. Um, <laughs> oh, heavy on the boundaries. <laughs> no, <I'm joking>. yeah. <laughs> Thank you both for coming on. That's Thank okay. you so much for it's hanging fun. out with me. Um, even though we're gonna drive home together now. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yes, I hope you enjoy this episode, a wonderful Christmas episode with the besties. Um, you can find me on Instagram at gugu, G-U-G-U dot S-G-B, and I can guarantee you there'll be tagged somewhere. But also follow um, at lovercode.florals on Instagram for some wonderful fresh flowers. More love and more life to you. Bye. Bye. Bye.